Howdy y'all, what's good? The White Tiger coming at you. Uh, brand new uh, Minecraft server, uh, 1.110 version of Minecraft, which is what I was trying to say. All the mods, uh, some some of the stuff that you saw last time, you know, I just generated that world in the last episode while I was bitching and griping about my fans. But anyways, on to some things. I'm going to start uh, with a little bit of a tutorial, I mean not tutorial, tour. What I've been uh, doing uh, so far in this mod pack, and uh, just basically kind of apologize at the same time. So, swing around here and coming at you with a full inventory. I've been trying to get sugar cane growing. Uh, frame rate still a little bit laggy, even if, but this is the base I decided to take over. I call it a base, it was some sort of house that was generated in this village that's right by here as you can see there's another house that generated along with it and this is a little village that Charles had found I just moved in there uh, nether portal and it's just it's an interesting little village 1.10 is just it's not 1710 because I finally got used to that after 164 but uh, I just don't like I really don't care to what the hell? Pink fences. Oh, it must be a texture glitch or something. I'm using a different uh, texture pack, but what was I saying? Damn it, I forgot. Anyways, I gotta say a little bit of a sorry. Uh, it's not that I wasn't, I was griping at by my fans the last time it was streamed, but I just, I felt like, you know, I had to get that off my chest. Now that I got that off my chest, I can kind of just get back to the basics and stuff uh anyways and this is a little garden i've been starting here and if you're wondering what the hell those things are there that's moving uh dang it I, okay that's worms from uh i don't even know actually additions mod for those that don't know um they actually help fertilize soil and water them at the same time it's a little nine by nine square so i've been kind of planting them accordingly except for this one it's just random but uh canola seeds from actually additions as well i kind of want to get into that mod but i just gotta get down to the basics of what i know i need to get into Batania, but i've already started off a little bit as you can already tell and see oh and by the way i got trolled i got trolled you'll see what i'm talking about as i'm going through and showing you the base but this is a rain shield apparently I wasn't aware of that, but uh, it's a very nice little present from Tronus. Thank you, Tronus. I appreciate that. But this thing is weird. Like, whenever rain actually does come, I wish... Hey, I wonder if there's a way... Let me cheat right quick. I'm sorry. This is the only time I'll ever cheat, but y'all gotta see this crazy stuff. I'm gonna move it eventually, but look at that. That's the rain shield. <laughs> it's just a bunch of freaking flames up in a little arrow going up. I might have to move this eventually, but I wanted to keep it here for the uh, the video. I need to dump my inventory, but uh, I've been uh, making crafting tables with Tinker's Construct, all the tool forges and all that stuff, and hi. Or, sort of. Missing a little piece, but that's okay. Hi. Uh, let's see. Well, looky what we got here. Gee, I wonder who it was that trolled me. I have no idea. Do you? Nah. It couldn't have been. It couldn't have been try trialless. No way. Uh, ex start expanding this a little bit. It is hard now. I remember why I like cobblestone and everything to build with because there's so much abundance of it. But man, this clay took me forever. Like, uh, oh, I had to show you another time. But uh, alright, here in a little bit if I can find it. But the tome of alchemy is alchemy Alca history. Whatever. It's from um, Re reliquary. I'll tell you about that. But uh, just random shizwiz, which I'm going to take care of all this stuff. I'll, I just have chests laying around. That's mostly ingots and some important stuff like mechanism and stuff. I need to get more into mech, but up here, I see, I, that's another reason why I need to expand. It's, I got so many things going on. I'm starting to anyways. Uh, this is from Refined Storage. Uh, this is uh, basically I have a disk drive, a solderer, and a crafting grid put together. And this is the disk drive. 
Uh, this is a crafting grid. Uh, I don't know if it works or not. I hadn't really tried it. And this is a solderer that makes all these little effing pieces. And it's, uh, uh, you know, I, I hate to craft things and do whatever, but I finally got to the point where I can almost make uh, one of these. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was making all these pads. We'll, we'll get back to that in a minute. I, I was making parts to be able to make a disk for the disk drive, and hopefully I'll make this thing work where I can just store some stuff in here and get rid of all these random shizwas chests around with r crazy stuff. Here's another mod that I happen to take a look at. It's called Correlated Potentialics. Uh, the actual mod... Oh, it doesn't show in there, but the mod says uh, that's... No, it must have been a website I saw off of, but anyways, uh, that's what you get for putting applied energistics uh, through a grammatical thesaurus or whatever. But uh, yeah. Oh, another troll. <laughs> I like it. I'm just going to leave all this stuff. I finally went and made an armor forge. Um, oh yeah, and one other thing, Charles. Uh, I have to switch around and apologize. I stole all your lava crystals, man. So I'm going to have to dig them up and get back and get you back some. But I had to make another uh, set of armor, lava armor here, because mine's on the verge of dying. And if you don't know what this is, this is from a mod called Armor Plus. Ah, hang on a sec. Armor Plus. I feel a lot more confident now. I feel like I could just you know, get through a video, and it's not like somebody's creeping up and looking up behind my shoulders anymore, but anyways, I chose the lava uh, armor because it, uh, it has resistance one and fire resistance, so like, I can virtually walk into lava and take no damage whatsoever, and of course I for once I actually oh, the uh, for once I actually made a anvil that says slightly damaged, but I actually enchanted my armor for once. I got protection one on there, projectile protection, all this stuff I just found in random dungeon chests. Which I'm gonna get to that as well. Protection one. Oh yeah, feather falling so that way I won't hurt as bad when I fall down. That's backup backup suit just in case I lose everything. I need to go get it. And I have this turned on so that way, or turned off so that way this won't suck on all the energy all the time. So I have it turned off right now. It's and when I was generating, but yeah. Okay, so there it goes again. I have a battery back here. You can't really see it, but it's a basic capacitor, right? Yeah. But I mean, this is this is just pretty cool. It's like applying energistics one, basically. I'm used to that, so I'm I'm kind of getting into this. I hope this disk drive thing works. But I'm about to do that here in a minute. Um, Ender IO standard stuff. Uh, metallurgic metallurgic infuser for mechanism, which I was going to get into that and. Uh, Got distracted as usual. Different color chests, so that way they won't combine together and go into hoppers into the machines and everything, yada yada. Uh, that was the original first. I started out with uh, making baguettes instead of bread, and that actually satisfies a little bit more. I actually tried to pretty up the place to keep all the plot, pots and plants and stuff, so I moved them around and. Oh, what's this? An arrow. And there's, yeah, another arrow pointing this way, so we gotta look up. T. Oh! Try was here. <laughs> of course, I already knew that, but you know, I've been seeing it ever since I started getting them back on and play. I hadn't been able to play much lately. This is about Friday night of like the weekend. I mean, the of the week when Tris is supposed to go on holiday. By the way, I wish him well. I hope he's having a great holiday. Man deserves it. He's been through enough as it is a lot, and I hope his mom is doing all right too. So yeah. Anyways, uh, blabbing on. Uh, skulls. I don't know why I want to show you that. Um, oh, trash can. Yeah. There's a lot of crap you'll find in 110 or especially this mod pack. Just I highly recommend making a trash can. Uh, hang on. Holy crap, y'all. Minor interruptions. And then I try to come back and, well, I get stuck on something. And then I come and find this mofo standing outside my doorstep. Okay, you scary as hell, man. Go on. Oh uh, yeah, I'm supposed to have a shield, I know, but look. How very anticlimactic. Psh, whatever. Since uh, I had the interruption, I think I'm uh go back to my snack that I was in the progress of, and then when I come back, we'll do something together. <laughs> Alright, hold on. Man, that had to have been the longest egg gum snack there ever was in the world. <laughs> nah, seriously, uh it's actually like 
more than a week later or so, and I uh, wanted to catch up right quick before I get started on episode two. So here's what's going on basically. Uh, as you can see, I got a jetpack now, and that's pretty cool. Uh, we've also updated the server to the latest, which is I think it's like one two uh, one point two three or something like that. But basically means that we got whoop I see two. <laughs> So that's what's up now. But uh, anyway, I just wanted to catch you up. I went ahead and just made the disk for the disk drive after all. And I uh, made two of them. And it's actually pretty good. It's just like uh, applied energistics. I mean, it's got the same thing. You have a little crafting table here and whatnot. Uh, I got this Ender Pouch from Ender Things or something like that. Uh, yeah. So it basically acts just like the regular old uh, Global Ender. Uh, nah, global Ender, uh, the stupid Ender chest before 1710 where I had these things, so now I got a pack linked up to that, and I can just get any time if I die or something, I can just recraft it and get all my stuff out again. Uh, this is the uh, Dark Armor that I've been working on, and uh, I'm eventually going to try to upgrade it and see what I can do with that, but uh, trying with that, and uh, I think that's all that. I also went ahead and got some more power going back up here. Let me step around and show you. I cleared all that out as you can see. I'm also got some uh, chests over there and you'll see why in just a moment. Finally got some of these uh, red orchids from Extra Utilities too. What they do is, as you can see, you put them on the redstone and they grow you redstone ore. So you just come by and just right click it and just get redstone. So that's pretty cool. I expanded on this a little bit. I didn't do too terribly much, but this is what I wanted to show you. The digital miner for mechanism, yes. So now I don't have to go mining or nothing. I can just let this puppy sit and run. And got an advanced energy cube up here, which is absolutely full. And the reason being is because I went and stole some windmills from Tyrannus. Uh He might be a little bit mad at me about that, but I'll just make up some more if that's the, the case. But uh, yeah, all these suckers are all running down. cube and the basic capacitor in there which I plan to upgrade eventually and we got our little rain shield thing up here now instead so it won't freak me out every time it sets a blaze like that but thank goodness no more rain so that's pretty much it it's uh the mod pack has been updated with new mods I can't wait to start with IC2 oh yeah I have a whole slew of sugar cane here as you can see oh and uh, this thing down here I wanted to show y'all right quick some sort of little fisher catcher thing water excuse me, water strainer thing, and that's the top part of it. It's, you have to put like a fisherman strainer. I'll put a fisherman strainer because it doesn't break, but you can put this bait pot in there. I mean, you're supposed to be able to get uh, whoops, uh, worms from dirt by actually digging up the dirt with a certain type of uh, oh, I forgot, a shovel or something like that. Yeah, this thing, garden trial. So uh, you use that to dig up just dirt and you get worms from that and then you can put them in there. It's different from the actually additions worms where you can put them down and they help you grow your garden over there. But uh, I think that's about it. I'm going to go ahead and end this episode and get started with the next episode. But yeah, this is what I've been doing. I've been having the digital miner pump out stuff and I've been putting it into Andrew chest. The Andrew chest comes down here and fills up all these chests instead, so I think it's, yeah, this one, all these lovely ores, ooh, eight diamonds, I gotta go grind them up, but, anyways, I think that's about it, I think everybody's caught up on everything, and yeah, uh, not enrichment chamber, metallurgic infuser, but, yeah, this thing's actually really cool, I'm really glad I went ahead and decided to make this, but, Oh well, until next time, this is your friendly neighborhood white tiger coming at you. Please don't like me. And there's a little video add-on thing that I wanted to start adding on to my video. I guess you would call it a intro. I was maybe thinking about putting it as an outro. I don't know yet, but it's just something to think about. But it was made by Mountain Dew Mania. And it, to me, it looks really cool, really awesome. So uh, when I get it to where it, sa it says not like instead of to like me, then I'll go ahead and put the video up but anyways i'll catch y'all later peace